Alright, so if you've ever been camping and you think to yourself, you know, I want to make some meals, backpacking, dehydrated meals, you think to yourself they're pretty expensive, right? Well, I think I have an alternative to the expensive meals that we've seen, such as Mountain House and other brands of dehydrated meals. And they can be very expensive, so I think I found an alternative to that. And we're going to show that today on this episode of the Texan Camper. So stick around. Rawr. Alright, so what I have here is I've got um, some different types of dehydrated, some convenient backpacking meals and or car camping meals that you could consider. And the main one that I want to highlight today is going to be the Bear Creek brand. I've seen this a couple times in the Walmarts and it looked really interesting and these are a special mix. This one I particularly picked up called the Darn Good Chili. And all you really have to do with something like these are dehydrated meals okay by Bear Creek and you just add water and for this particular one you add tomato paste and it serves eight cups that is a lot of food now these two meals here I got one that's cheddar potato the other one is the darn good chili of course the darn good chili doesn't have any beef in it but all you gotta do is you can ground up some beef like this and add it to it and you also have to add a single 8 ounce can of paste uh, tomato paste just to help with the consistency and the texture and to thicken it up and that's all you really have to do the price of these is about three dollars and nine cents each and this has eight servings and the only real prep work you have to do is add water and a can of that tomato paste. For the cheddar potato, this also makes eight cup servings. All you have to do is add water. It's basically, these are dehydrated meals, ready to go. Now I'm going to point out some pros and cons, because you also are going to see here, I have the Mountain House Beef Stew, and I'm going to go over this one, as well as the Beef Stroganoff, we'll go over this one as well. Another item that I have here and I've cooked out in the campsites, this can also be for backpacking, but it's called the Uncle Ben's Ready Rice. And these come in multiple flavors. This is the Spanish style. And the way I prepare these in the field, camping, hiking, whatever, is you basically cook these in boiling water because it's already pre cooked, so you don't have to cook it. Now, at home, you can make these in the microwave, but at the campsite, you just boil this in water. For about a good five to ten minutes and that'll get that nice and hot for you these are only a dollar great for backpacking so consider this one as well from uncle ben's they're called the ready rice and they come in multiple flavors so that's one meal you can do there that's quick and easy and lightweight so let's get to the pros and cons here the mountain house okay the pros about this 
is that you can cook it in the bag. With the Bear Creek meals, these guys here, you have to actually stove cook those or do more prep work. You can't cook them in the bag. So that's a pro with this and a con with the Bear Creek. Another benefit of the Mount House meals is that it only takes two cups of water to cook this meal. You need eight cups for the Bear Creeks. So again, you just need more water. Not a big deal. Now, the Mountain House meals, okay, are convenient, like I said, because you just need two cups of water. You cook them in the bag. But the con of this is that these are $7.99 each, and you only have two servings, very small portions. These, whether it's the chili or the cheddar potato, whatever flavor, make eight servings, so you can feed a, a better portion of the, of the whoever's at your campsite with you. So if you were to camp with these or backpack, like say you're camping with multiple people, this would feed a lot more people for cheaper than buying just one of these. Eight dollars versus this is three dollars. That's a huge difference. Yes, you can backpack with this. You have to do more prep work, but it's not a big deal. You can add the ground beef, which was only two dollars and eighty cents plus the three. I'm at about five dollars and eighty cents right there, okay, and ninety cents. I'd say eighty cents. So for about six fifty, I'm getting more food than I'm getting with this for eight dollars. So you have to weigh those options out. This is lightweight, only two cups of water, quick and easy. You cook it in the bag. That might be great if you need to do that, okay, for eight dollars. But if you've got space in your backpack for the water, eight cups of water to cook this, some ground beef, can of paste, or even just bring this one, eight servings. The calories alone is 180 calories per serving, so this is 800 calories in here if you can eat this whole thing. This right here is 130 calories times eight servings. That's 800 calories, not counting the beef that you put in there, as well as this. So there's plenty of calories in these to make those work. So I just wanted to point these things out. Bear Creek is sold at Walmart. You can pick these up at Walmart for, like I said, for $3.09. Super cheap, dehydrated meals. They can also be good for uh, food storage, too. Um, let's see if it says it on here. This is It says Best Buy December of 2017. So that's not a bad, sh it's a short shelf life. It's not very long. The Mountain House shelf life says, let's see if it's on here. It says best by 2027, okay? That's almost 30 years. 30 years on that. Let's see if I can get that to focus in. Come here. No way you can believe me. Best by September of 2027. That's a long shelf life. Okay, that's another pro. So for long-term shelf life, Mountain House beats everything. But for the immediate use, folks, these Bear Creek meals, especially this one, I'm going to cook this one up tonight and uh, just make myself some lunch for the week. But uh, I just wanted to show you that this tastes just as good as a mountain house meal and it's cheaper and you get more bang for your buck so pick yourself up some bear creek at the walmart and see what you think and leave some comments below if you've used these before um, and that's really about it so on this episode I just wanted to kind of show you guys some quick and easy inexpensive dehydrated meals that you can make you know that i've used many a times before I'm starting to use these Bear Creeks. They make great meals, uh, good volume. I'm interested to see what the cheddar potato tastes like. I'm sure that's going to taste fantastic. I'm going to put some of this hamburger meat and cook up some of this darn good chili because that stuff right there is fantastic. So that's pretty much it. Hope this episode helped you out, kind of figuring out the meals that you want to backpack with or cook on the campsite with the kids and family. And um, pretty much until we meet again, folks, take care.